I see you watching me when we're with our friends. It's definitely something in the air. So let's take it from there, cause I know you want it. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Emily. If you are a returning subscriber, your friend, or my favorite person, and you don't even know it yet, we're starting off this vlog on a Tuesday because I was busy yesterday editing the vlog that went up last week. Yeah, by the time you get this, it will be last week. So um, um, I'm back from uh, Naivasha, the girls' trip. And uh, work is calling, so I've been working for the better part of the morning, and now it's in the afternoon. I haven't had breakfast yet. Let me show you what I want to have. So I'm having green tea lemon with some chicken sausages, and then I wanted to make fresh juice with these mangoes. Some of them are in the fridge, so I'll just cut out the bad part and make fresh juice they are in that state because i wasn't at home when they got in that state um, uh, i want to step out that's why i'm a bit dolled up i want to go do grocery shopping because i like making my juice tropical so it ought to have mangoes pineapples passion fruits or uh, the seedless oranges or i can just squeeze some orange juice if i don't get them so the house also doesn't have a few essentials including water i can see there's an extra gallon of water with no water so i need to go do grocery shopping uh let me have my breakfast and then um, uh, i'll submit the outfit of the day as well as the scent of the day as i'm stepping out all right yeah see you guys in a few you guys some of my body items are showing me flames because tell me why some of my favorite stuff decided to be over in january these are here because i want to come and clean them as soon as i'm back home this is my foundation i usually get it at Linton's, and it's over now thank god i have an extra one but the reason i have an extra one is i always have the fear that i could go and find that they haven't stocked it. That's why I always buy two. Last I bought these was uh, around 7,000 and that was early last year. So I'm sure it's not the same price and that doesn't mean that it's lower. That means the price of yesterday is not the price of today. It's way much expensive than I bought it last time. Yo, but I don't think I'm going to get it. I am going to pass by Linton. Mm -hmm because uh, there is a lippy that I was uh, looking for. I had sent my friend when uh, he traveled to Netherlands, but he didn't find it. So let me see if I can find it in Kenya, of which I doubt. But let's see, let's see. Let me I'll pass by and see if they have it. If they have it, I'll get it. And then this is also over. Yo, guys, the audacity of these items to finish in January of all the months there could be. Anyway let me submit the outfit of the day as well as the scent of the day starting off with those sunglasses those are from style smith one on instagram check them out i love them they match with that hairstyle uh lippy is um toxic by shop new level these earrings i think were from forever trendy it's a bit sunny so sorry if the lighting is off the shirt is from chica chica is at kilimani mall shop number g08 this denim skirt is from uh, shane i got it a while back i think last year or last year but one i'm not sure my bag is the same one that i had in the previous vlog and those are the shoes of the day i almost wore my dior sandals but i think these look way better than the sandals these are from um jamia mall shop number f69 and that is the outfit of the day i love it it's giving casual which i'm very much okay with scent of the day is uh, somewhere behind here it is this one this is aqua di Gio by giorgio amani in the scent absolute i love this i love it so much so that 
it hasn't finished one year yet it's almost but you can tell i have been wearing it and generously so that's it that's the outfit of the day let me head out and i'll catch you guys when i'm back protector it is you that holds us together someone must have broken my heart like really torn it apart in another life in another life someone must have really me up like caused my heart to stop in another life in another life otherwise i don't know why i keep coming back to this keep fighting all of it don't trust that there's love to give I don't know why, I just can't believe in it Like somehow I can't commit, guess I have to yes, admit it. Yeah, I got an issue with love, yeah, I got an issue with trust Really about it opening up, oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I got an issue with love, yeah, I got an issue with trust Worry that it won't be enough, oh, oh, yeah. Someone must have made me feel bad but who I was and what I had to give, oh. Someone must have told me a lie, really played with my mind in another life. Otherwise, I don't know why I keep coming back to this, keep fighting all of it. Don't trust that there's love to get. Let me share a very quick grocery haul because i wasn't going to buy too many items not sure if i stuck to the budget <laughs> or the reason is that i didn't find some of the items like the air week the one that you refill there was no milk as well but i did stick to the budget passed by where is it linton's and <laughs> Foundation is now 9,000 and some loose change. Guys, we have to look for money. Because, yo, we have to look for money. Let me do a quick haul. So, at Kafo, I got toilet paper. I used Tena. I got soft facial tissues. I got a multi-purpose. This is not a multi-purpose. It's more of like a kitchen towel. I got Star Soft. I got Morning Fresh. I only had the paste. I prefer to have both the paste and the liquid. And then I got this sanitizing hand washed. I loved the scent. I got this movable stick for making chapatis and uh, pizza. Mine is purposely for pizza because the other one that I own, I have been using it as my nyundo. Is nyundo called hammer in uh, English? Yeah. I have been using mine for that. I got uh, Vaseline Coco Radiant Body Oil. I love that on my body. I got a lemon saver. So when you cut your lemon and you want to save some and store in the fridge, you just store it here and it's safe and fresh if you want to use it again. I got Jig. I got some pens. I got Sunlight. I got Fruit Nut. I got Ushindi. I got tiny tots containers. I use this to store like mushroom sauce, sweet, any sauce, sweet chili sauce, or uh, any other type of sauce, or even tiny, tiny uh, leftovers. You can store these without taking up too much space in the fridge. I got uh, rolls. I got Omog. Oh Look at it, it's so cute. I'm happy to report of the three mugs that I was to buy, I restrained myself to this one, which will be my cup of coffee for tomorrow. I love it. Look at it. It was the only one remaining. And that was the reason. <laughs> you guys, one thing about me is I will defend to death a mug purchase. But yeah, got that mug. I got my cappuccino di Torino. And then I got some cheese. This is uh, mozzarella cheese. This is to make uh, pasta carbonara. I don't know if I had told you guys before I left that I wanted to make pasta carbonara. We had it 
for the girl strip and it has been on my mind since so i want to try and make it at home because i loved it i really really loved it for someone who has a love and hate relationship with cheese i was shocked that i actually loved loved that meal and because i know my relationship with cheese I didn't buy a big packet, just these for once or twice, the usage. And then, um, in case I hadn't mentioned, I got crepes. Over here, we have um, capsicum, we have coriander, we have lettuce, we have mango, apple. I got two. Why are they selling mangoes at 60 bob each? That wasn't very wise of me to purchase from the supermarket. This is passion fruit. Mm, I got this passion fruit to make juice with uh, those mangoes and a pineapple. And I will also add orange, which should be that's zucchini. But these are oranges. Yeah, I want to make fresh juice because I have very ripe fruits with me. I got a soda and I got... Um, more fatty bacon to make the pasta carbonara so i'll just store that one that i was defrosting back to the freezer since this is what is left let me do a quick haul from the basket there is my water and then this is uh, baked beans these are grapes i have a theory guys the darker the grape the sweeter the juice that i believe firmly believe Literally, quite literally, that's what I mean. I got a uh, pineapple coconut yogurt. It's one of my favorites from Dairyland together with the kiwi apple. So I got three of those. I got uh, fresh mixed veggies. There was no milk in the supermarket, so I opted for just these. Uh, I think these are 50 ml. Yeah, I got two 50 ml. I got French beans, which are cut out. And then I got, oops, oops, oops. I hope it didn't pour. I got this uh, fresh beef, so I will make pizza with this so that I can make a beef barbecue pizza. Thinly, thinly cut so that it turns out perfect. I got cooking cream. I wasn't sure if I had that. And then I got tropical mix juice. Uh, this uh, parmesan cheese is for making pizza and this should be coconut milk in case I hadn't mentioned that this is chili beef cubes and last but not least what is this honey what is this oh this is lemon right lemon yeah lemon last but not least i passed by lcy kiki and i got myself this cute knit dress i got it in a size large because you just never know you just never know when it comes to me because uh, medium is showing me flames so i just wanted a perfect fit and uh, i got it on offer so initial price was 5190 and i got a 46% discount to 2790 it has a belt on it which looks like so it's a very long knit dress i didn't check if it had a slit but i don't think it had a slit but yeah that was all the stuff that i got at the hub let me pack these things quick and then we can start making a uh, early dinner or um, late lunch and make juice as well all right see you guys as i'm uh, making dinner so for the fresh juice these are three overripe mangoes apple mangoes but you got to be careful to check out if they are worms if they are i suggest you don't touch the entire mango just throw it these are three passion fruits and then i'm going to squeeze these one big orange in there and i'm going to make all these with half of this pineapple and then blend them all together i'm starting off with the juice so that it can be chilling in the fridge as i make the pasta
fingertips, it's magic when we kiss. I can be myself with you, kiss me now, I insist. Make me yours, just take me now, I'm helpless to so guys for the genuine pasta carbonara you do not need mushrooms however i'm adding a little bit of mushroom and garlic to mine you need the fatty area of the pork but i'm using bacon uh, pork or uh, bacon is recommended and then i don't have dill so i'm going to garnish with dania you need parmesan cheese you do not need cooking cream instead instead you need um uh, what is it an egg but something about not cooking an egg like eating a raw egg doesn't sizzle well with my spirit so i am improvising so uh, that is why i'm using the cooking cream with the mushrooms and what else haven't i mentioned of course you need the pasta and then uh, you'll start off with these and then i'll fry these and then uh, when I am done, I will mix my pasta with everything that is in here. Garnish with uh, black pepper. And I will also use uh, cheese to cook. But I'm going to show you guys. And those are the ingredients for Emily's pasta carbonara. Let's get into it. and that is my dinner for today pasta cabanora the veggies on the side are for sure paid actors and uh, a glass of fresh juice guys if you eat these i promise you you're going to gain weight this is such a cheat meal but also worth it so if you're looking to gain weight eat these on the regular but if you're on a diet, I suggest that you make it your cheat meal. Alright? I have so much Ratchet TV to catch up on. So I'm going to enjoy my meal as I watch. And then I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, guys. It's the following day. I want to make a quick breakfast because I have pending work that needs to be done. ASAP pending administrative work so i'm making a quick breakfast of uh, i'm just recreating everything that i enjoyed while we were at the girls trip so i'm going to make 
the leftover bacon that I didn't cook yesterday and then with that oil and some butter I'm going to make some sauteed mushrooms with garlic and glazed uh, carrots I might have that with uh, one of that or not and I'm going to have that with a cup of coffee and then get to work so let's make this very fast to be honest i don't think about you to be honest i got better things to do to be honest i don't care that we're over been fine since you told me you don't love me anymore to be honest i like sleeping alone yeah i'm totally your arms around me i don't need you to tell me it's gonna be all right my love you think i'm lying to myself but the truth is i don't need you because i'm one in a million and that means i'll find a better you someday. good morning my lovelies today is uh today should be thursday right yep it's very early in the morning and it's very cold instead of using the mirror <laughs> i'm using my camera uh it's very cold it's actually drizzling outside mm, it's around 7 30 no 7 40 -ish. something i've showered Prep scent of the day is going to be let's find a sample. Let's find a sample that we love. Is it that I can't find or I just don't want to look? I think most of my favorite samples are in my handbag, that's why. Okay, let's wear it. Jado by Dior almost over. I have like two years left. I love these when I want to smell elegant and mature. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Let's start off the day. I want to make breakfast. I feel like having um what do I feel like having? I'll have one of those rolls with some veggies inside there and a spicy chicken sausage and that will be my breakfast and then i jump on right to work work until three and then i'll find something to watch as the day ends right so that is uh the plan for today i can't find one of these i washed this one and i usually have two Maybe it's also in my bag. All right, let's get the day started. So for my salad, I have lettuce, red bell pepper, a red onion. It's the best for making salads. A small piece of cucumber and um, like two slices of, uh, of pineapple. Thinly sliced. And then for my salad dressing, I have put in there some like two drops of olive oil half a lemon squeeze the other half is what i store in this lemon saver and uh, what else have i added there focus and i have also grinded a little bit of a fireball these are my spicy chicken sausages i have cut each into half so that they fit in my toasted rolls and then i will mix the salad and have it with my toasted rolls And that is my breakfast. For dinner, I'll have, uh, sorry, for lunch, I'll have this salad. And then for dinner, I defrosted some dingo that I have. And I'll make it with some nice moya pishori rice that I got home from uh, the holidays. I want to work from my living room because sometimes I get tired if I sit too long in my 
so I switch in my dining so I switch and then um work as I listen to music and then uh, we will catch up as the day goes along all right Guys, I wanted popcorn, but ordering popcorn only from Carrefour would have been a waste of my money. So this is the popcorn that I ordered, and then I ordered some other stuff so that I can make good use. <laughs> you know that's some girl math, so that I can make good use of my delivery fee, which turned out to be free anyway. So this is uh, what we had on the girls' trip. I really loved it. So. I bought a bottle for me. I forgot to buy it when I was doing uh, grocery shopping. Some more bacon. And uh, and a big pineapple, which is that. Yeah, so those four items. But most, important, but most importantly, I was craving popcorn. So I'll make that tomorrow. I'll probably make caramel popcorn if I don't step out. Good morning, guys. Today is Friday. The weather is a bit shifty. It is sunny, but it's also raining. I want to call Samido to change that plant because I don't like the way it looks. The rest are okay. I had plans to go to the office and I have the outfit actually for this weather but I just have one Zoom meeting from 12 to 1 and I feel like I can take that from uh, home so I want to be going to the office my cleaning lady is coming I wanted her to do a thorough cleaning but the way the weather is set up I think she's just going to do the normal cleaning and then on another day she can do the thorough cleaning also um, I have ordered mandazis I have missed I have missed mandazis from my local. I want to have those with a cup of coffee. And then um, uh, I also plan on making pizza tomorrow, not today. So I think I will make the dough tonight or very early tomorrow in the morning. And then we will make pizza during the day tomorrow. That is the plan for today actually. So we will catch up guys as the day goes along for now i'm just going to have breakfast and then later on jump right into work and that will be my friday for today easy peasy lemon squeezy meeting is done don't we love a quick meeting we do we love a quick meeting over here so i'm going to make popcorns and have a glass of wine because my friday has officially started and then um uh, if i don't talk to you guys again i'll see you tomorrow Sorry, you're gonna be the This
Here is my caramelized popcorn. I just need to detangle it using my hands like that. It's okay. And that's my pizza dough. You're supposed to make it two hours just before you cook, store it in the fridge. But the longer, the longer it stays, the better. That is my cleaning lady's lunch. She's told me how she's going to take popcorn to her baby. So there is her lunch. Mimi, I'm going to have popcorns and a glass of wine and then for dinner i'll eat the leftover dingo and rice that is still remaining i was multitasking as i was making this that's why you see everything is dirty but it's going to be wiped all right guys i'll see you later on Just wanna watch them stars fall But you don't wanna try to make up dreams Just to be seen I wanna lay here beside you Oh quiet Fire breath and open sky It's not what we know it's where we go I go wings and tell her goodbye oh, It's not what we see It's what we choose to be Good about the morning today is Saturday yo I have overplayed that uh lip gloss yeah today is Saturday I just want to rest and just be a couch potato uh, but first we need to make breakfast i want to have a leftover mandazi with tea grab some popcorn and uh, that will be my breakfast for today i left the pizza dough overnight i didn't put it in the fridge i told you guys so right i think so so it has risen to the occasion look at it oh my god oops 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 there it is i will make pizza for late lunch because I usually don't eat lunch most of the days. I will grab some of this popcorn, but for now I need some hibiscus lemon tea, which is what I'm going to make. Sorry for the background noise. Turns out I have no hibiscus tea, so I'm uh, making lemon, green lemon tea with uh, leftover mandazi from yesterday. I'll see you guys as you're making pizza, all right? and bare feet Oh But you each second is a tree Time for me to make the pizza. So this is finely chopped beef that I'm going to add cornstarch and then fry with uh, some garlic. I am yet to uh, chop some garlic. And then when the meat is cooked, I'll just add some uh, red onion and this finely chopped uh, cilantro so i have so much dough that is why i'm going to make two pieces of pizza like two sets right so one is going to have mushroom and uh, the other one is just going to have beef and uh, red bell pepper green bell pepper topping with some onions here's my cheese and this is my pizza sauce the beef i am going to I fry it also in um, barbecue sauce. I might add pineapples, guys. I might add pineapples onto the pizza that I'm going to add uh, mushrooms. It's all about experimenting, guys. It's all about experimenting. So let's get into it. In case I didn't mention, I have shared this recipe before, but I think I was making it with chicken in a previous video. Just type Emily WK Pizza and you should be able to get the recipe. So 
So you start off with the pizza sauce. This is capote pizza sauce. And then cheese, mozzarella cheese, here we go, just a little for me, if you love cheese, well and good, spread that evenly, and then you go in with your toppings. And then I'm going to add onions with my hands, guys. Please excuse me. Lots and lots of red onion. I'm going to add more bell peppers. And then last but not least, add some more cheese. And then into the oven, it will go for 15 minutes in 200 degrees. And there you have it. It should be done in 15 minutes. The other one is the one that I'm going to put the mushrooms and pineapples and uh, some of these barbecue beef that I made with cornstarch in case I didn't mention that. All right, guys, I think we're good to go. I didn't put a lot of cheese because I didn't want a lot of cheese in mine. But I need to make sure it's evenly spread because I can see it's mostly at the center there. And we need to make sure it's everywhere. Make sure you preheat your oven for at least 15 to 20 minutes. Guys, this is how I get burnt, by the way. That is exactly how. All right, in 15 minutes, I'll show you guys. Oh, oh, oh. guys the second one is overwhelmed by toppings and i can tell it might turn out to be a disaster because of that spacing everything might pour especially with the cheese might spread or pour into the sides 15 minutes as well Balance next to you it's true nowadays there's nothing i wouldn't Yo guys, I'm already demolishing the first one as the other one cooks. If you get overwhelmed by cheese, the trick is to add more pizza sauce to your pizza dough when you're uh, assembling it so that it's uh, manageable for you. Yo guys, this is so good. Guys, it turned out well. It didn't spread so much over the other side. It looks like so. This is technically my lunch, late lunch, that is dinner, tomorrow lunch, tomorrow dinner. So I'm sorted for the next two days. Go binge watch something and I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Good morning. Today is Sunday and this is my breakfast. Uh, chicken sandwich and uh, triple cappuccino. So I'm going to end this vlog here. I hope you enjoy it. I have shared so many recipes and I hope you guys try them out and let me know what you think. Thank you so much for tuning in and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye.